Did you know that your general health can affect your oral health? Welcome to another episode of Time with the Dentist. My name is Dr. Gwendolyn Namakwe Baiche, and this is proudly sponsored by Pepsodent in partnership with Ghana Dental Association. Certain conditions related to our general health can have erosive effect on our teeth, and I'd like to draw your attention to some of these conditions. But before that, you should note that the stomach is a part of the body where there is high production of acid to aid in digestion. Acid has the ability to remove some of the minerals of our teeth, like calcium, in a process known as demineralization. So any condition that will cause the stomach contents to move into the mouth will cause acid to come into contact with our teeth. The first condition I'd like to talk about is GERD, gastroesophageal reflux disease, also known as acid reflux. This digestive disease occurs when the acid content of the stomach flows up the esophagus or windpipe and into the mouth at regular intervals, worse after eating or when lying down. So you may feel heartburns or pain in the chest. Conditions that cause frequent vomiting, like pregnancy at certain trimesters, as well as bulimia, where one forces themselves to vomit after binge eating, can cause the acid content of the stomach to come into contact with the teeth, contributing to erosion of the teeth. For those of us who take lemon juice and apple cider vinegar, it's best to do this with a straw to avoid direct contact with the teeth. With alcoholic beverages being acidic, chronic alcoholism can have erosive effect on the teeth. When the outermost layer of our teeth, enamel, is exposed to acid over a long period of time, it begins to wear down. And so you may feel sensitivity or pain with hot or cold fluids. The teeth get weak and gradually break down. You may develop cavities as well as discoloration of the teeth over time. If you experience any of these conditions I've mentioned earlier, consult a physician. It helps with swallowing, yeah. Well, saliva, we can say, serves as lubricants. It hates in uh, peristalsis. That is uh, the eating of food and then the, the traveling of food into the pyloric and the cardiac side, which is the stomach itself. And then it also contains some antiseptics, which are good for the buccal cavity. If you don't brush your teeth. What makes the mouth smell? Uh, one, bad dental care, which may lead into a mouth odor. Saliva keeps the tissues of our mouth moist and comfortable for eating and talking. It helps in digestion of food and also neutralizes any acidity in the mouth. There are many causes of bad breath, some of which include not brushing your teeth and flossing properly twice a day, cavities in your teeth that can pack food, gum diseases, eating spicy foods regularly, including garlic and onions, smoking, and chronic alcoholism. Erosion of your teeth can cause you to require extensive dental treatment or even lose your teeth. Visit a dentist for more advice on how to prevent your teeth from wearing away. Remember to floss and brush your teeth twice a day with a fluoride containing toothpaste like Pepsodent. This campaign is proudly sponsored by Pepsodent in partnership with Ghana Dental Association.